Hello, I'd like to tell you the story of the Tower of Babel. After the flood, Noah had children, and his children had children, and so on and so forth, and they became a mighty nation. One of those people we hear of and are even given a title, Nimrod the Mighty Hunter. It was supposedly the person who started Babel, or Babylon maybe. And the people decided to make bricks. Nothing strange in that. And they made bricks. And they made a city. And while they were making a city, they decided they'd make a tower. Not just any nice tower to see the round land all the way around, but a tower to get them into heaven. Bypassing all the rules, all the things that they're supposed to do to get into heaven. And this was not to be. The Lord did not want them even thinking that it was a good idea to skip all the steps to going into heaven. So, he forced them to spread around. How did he do this? Well, he did this by changing the language. Now, this could have been a natural phenomenon of different classes of people or little groups of people being so insular that they couldn't communicate to other people. Or it could have been a, you guys talk that way, you guys talk that way, you guys talk that way, and you guys go ahead and talk that way. Because all these people, they now talked differently. More than just the South talks differently than the North here, but they were thinking differently. They became enemies to each other because they didn't understand each other. And so they spread out and covered the whole earth. So what about families? In the Book of Mormon, there's a, a story of the brother of Jared who lived during this time. And Jared asked his brother, the brother of Jared, to pray and bless his family that they would not lose their ability to communicate with each other. So therefore the righteous people still had to be spread out. But the righteous people were able to stick with each other even as they were forced to go spread out to different areas. I hope you love your family, and I hope you stay righteous. That was a really strange story.